Hello everyone and welcome to uh, another Chris's Collection. We are playing uh, the, the Mario game of uh, the GameCube, the successor, if you would, to Super Mario 64, Super Mario Sunshine. Um, oh man, so where do I start? So, uh, Mario Sunshine... Um, excuse me. Um, let's erase. Ooh. Um, Mario Sunshine, uh, I actually did not buy at launch. Um, I had actually so many fucking opportunities to get this game. Th there's a really funny story to this. So, basically, I knew this game was coming out, um, and when I moved out of, uh, of Miami, uh, or not Miami, um, my small town that I lived in, uh, I just didn't really care to get it. Um, I just didn't. I was like, whatever, man. Fucking Mario. I was kind of like out of gaming. I was in this weird, depressive state. And, um, so I just kind of let it go and, um, didn't pay attention any. And, uh, um, whatever. I just let it kind of do its thing. And then, um, years would pass and, God, I remember I was at a Best Buy. And um, we had just moved to Miami, and we were at this Best Buy, and the game was marked down to, like, 20 bucks. And I remember holding the game in my hands and saying, should I get it? And I went, nah, and I put it back, and I don't remember what I got, but I got something else. And um, I regretted that. I was like, why'd you do that, man? Um, and so, whatever, uh, years pass, and... Um, my friend, uh, uh, Brian, who I talk about a lot, he, he got the game. And, um, uh, you know, he had a, he had a GameCube? No, he had a Wii, I think. Or, I don't remember now. And we would play this game, like, all the time. Um, it's actually in one of my movies. Uh, one of my early, I think it was my, the fifth movie I ever made. I had one of the characters wake up and immediately start playing, um, Mario Sunshine. Kind of like Brody with, uh, you know, what he played in, um in Mario, uh, I mean, in, uh, Mallrats. Um, it was, like, my homage to that. And, um, so, uh, you know, we would play, and I'm like, whatever, I kind of got, like, my, my, uh, my hit, you know, my fixes or whatever, what have you, uh, from playing at my friend's house. And, um, years passed, and, you know, this game, it was always, like, the missing link in my collection. Like, I had all the Mario games, like, main series ones, except for Sunshine. And I remember when Wii U came out, I was like, oh, they have to, they have to release this as a GameCube, you know, like a, a virtual console, right? They never did, and I got so fucking tired of that that I said, fuck this, I'm just gonna buy it. I own a GameCube, I can play this game. So, uh, I did that. I said, fuck it, and I bought a GameCube, um, uh, or not, I'm sorry, I didn't buy a GameCube. I decided I'm gonna get this game. So, um, I did get this game eventually, many years later, and, uh, uh, it was pretty funny. I, I went on Amazon and I bought it and I was like, yeah, I got it. And I was like so stoked about it. Um, and uh, <laughs> um, I got the game and I was so excited. I'm like, oh, dude, it's an original print because it wasn't like the player's choice or whatever. It was like the original print of the game. And I, I uh, you know, it was going to come in. It was going to take a little bit longer. And I'm like, oh, it's all good. It's all good, man. I'll wait. And, like, the, the person who was selling it, it was, like, an Amazon seller or whatever, and he was like, yeah, guaranteed to work. Trust me, it's been professionally clean. And I'm like, professionally clean? Uh, I wait, like, I don't know, like a week or so, and the game comes in, and I'm so excited, and I pop it into my GameCube, doesn't fucking work. And I'm like, oh, really? Doesn't fucking work, man. And I got so bummed out. And then um, I thought, oh, shit, maybe my GameCube's broken. I tried like three games, three random games. They all worked perfectly fine. And it became very clear it wasn't my GameCube that was at fault. It was the fucking disc. So I looked at it and the disc looked fine. It wasn't broken or, you know, fucked up or anything like that. It looked perfectly fine. So I like cleaned it the best I could. Um, I, I went online and like followed all the recommendations of like how to clean properly. Like, you know, you never do the circular motion. You kind of like brush outward. Uh, did everything under the sun. Did not fucking work. So I'm like, this is broken. So I labeled it as a defective um, and I sent it back to Amazon 
and I got all my money back. And then um, I said, all right, let me look around. And I found one uh, that it was in the case and uh, I had the instruction manual and I was like, oh man, it has the instruction manual. And uh, the only catch was it was a... Um, it was the player's choice one. And I was like, dude, you know what? At this point, fuck it. Like, I don't give a shit. Like, at this point, I just want the goddamn game. I don't care if it's player's choice. And uh, so it came in. And um, it is in perfect condition. The case looks incredible. Like, whoever owned this game took very good care of it. The disc works 100% perfectly fine. The instruction manual looked great and I was like so fucking stoked that I finally had a working copy and yes it did work <laughs> of uh, Mario Sunshine and um, yeah so I was just really happy that the game thing came out and um, I was able to like finally play through it and have fun and all that good stuff and yes that is finally the story of how I got Super Mario Sunshine. Took such a long time. I really hope that Nintendo remasters this game one day. Like, I think they really should consider doing... Um, well, at this point, what is it? Like, they have SNES and NES uh, Virtual Console on um, part of Nintendo Switch Online. Supposedly, there's a rumor we might get N64. That'd be really cool. Um, I don't know. I mean, I guess if we get N64, maybe they'll squeeze in GameCube, but I, I'm starting to think maybe GameCube is going to be somewhere down the line. I don't know. Or maybe just they, they'd never cross that that line. I have no idea. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for listening and watching. Um, we will be back uh, later this week with another... Or, I'm sorry, next week with uh, the last of the S's as we, uh, you know, segue into... Uh, last three games of the GameCube, so check out that. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Take care.